ClickUpVersusMonday.com free plans. Hey guys, today I'm going to be giving you a detailed comparison between ClickUp and Monday and their free programs. So we're only going to be taking a look at their free versions. Any of their premium versions we're not going to be considering today. So let's jump into it. First off, we have ClickUp over here and I am going to compare their um, features first and then I am going to show you guys the general user experience that you are going to receive on the free versions of both of these project management software. So first off, the basic difference. In the free version of ClickUp, you can add as many people as you want, while in the free version of Monday, you can only add two people. So that is something that's going to be a major deciding factor on which project management software you're going to use. So if you have more than two people working, if you need it for your business, you're going to opt for ClickUp. But if you need it just for your personal use, you can even use Monday.com. Now where ClickUp lacks is the limited number of spaces. So you can only create five different workspaces on the free version of ClickUp. However, on Monday.com, you can create as many boards as you want to and you can have as many different views as you want to as well. Now, in terms of file storage, you get 100 MBs of file storage and click up while on Monday, you get 500 MBs of file storage. So Monday is a bit ahead in terms of storage, but there are a few essentials that are really lacking on Monday and I'll get to those in a second. Now, you can't add guests on ClickUp and neither can you do that on Monday. So that's something that is a um, zero zero for both of these. Now on advanced features, you have portfolios. You can add a hundred users portfolios, which is very helpful for ClickUp. And on ClickUp, you can also add a hundred goals as well. Now uh, you can only use this a hundred times, so you have to beware, but still it's a good number and it's very unlikely that you're gonna run out of it very soon. Now you also get a hundred mind maps, a hundred dashboards, and a hundred automations a month on ClickUp. However, on Monday.com, as you guys can see over here, you do not get any of those map views, chart views at all. So not even a hundred or a 10 or anything like that. You don't get those views at all. You don't even get a timeline view on Monday on its free version. And you also don't get any sort of automations as well. So that is something that is very lacking on Monday. And if your project is a large project, these kinds of tools are going to be essential for your business. And Monday not having those is going to really inhibit your progress. Now, in more features that ClickUp has and uh, Monday does not have is the table view that is in the form of spreadsheets. Monday does not provide that in the free version as well. And then you have some high level features like uh, cloud storage, Gantt charts. You can't really get those on either, but ClickUp does provide you with at least 100 uses of Gantt charts and 10 uses of milestones and 100 uses of proofing, which one day does not provide at all. And then also ClickUp provides you with 50 plus native integrations. So basic integrations like Zoom, Microsoft Teams, Shopify, all of those are available. The basic ones are gonna be present. Then you also get time tracking on, on ClickUp, whereas on Monday, you don't get integrations or time tracking. So you can see there is no time tracking on the free version of Monday over here. Then on ClickUp, you also get a Zapier and Integromat feature integration, you could say. And if you're using those as previously, and it might be very helpful if you just move all of your data from ClickUp to there, have your data to be uh, easily exchangeable within your platforms. And uh, it, it's gonna help you manage your projects a lot better. Now, Monday does provide you with 24 seven customer support, whereas ClickUp does not, but uh, I really, um, ClickUp does provide it as well. Oh, so they have changed their policies. ClickUp does provide 24-7 customer support and so does Monday.com. Over here, you can see they do provide 24-7 customer support. So that is a good feature for both of them. Now, this was just the basic general comparison. Now I'm gonna move on and show you guys how the free versions of these applications actually look like. Now you can see over here, this is the free version of ClickUp.com and it's very appealing it looks just as good and even if this was a paid version even if all of these features were paid for i would still think that they are worth it because the general uh, appeal in their um, templates and their general 
uh, workflow and organization automations, especially automations, because automations are a feature that not all project management softwares are providing right now for free. And that's like a huge cherry on top for ClickUp where Monday is really going to fall short, especially if you are someone that doesn't have enough time and needs to keep things moving, even without you being present. Now, over here, I've clicked on a task on ClickUp, and if I want to view this task, I can just add myself as a watcher, so I can view the progress on this task. And a good thing about this is I can see all of these details of the project, so the cost, the number of hours, location, all of these things. And I can even add a subtask within the task just by clicking on a certain task. Also, I can add more attachments as well. I can add them from my Google Drive, my Dropbox, a new document or a file as well. I can also estimate the time that is going to be required for this task. And if I want anyone else to be watching this task or monitoring this task, I can add them as well. Well, if I move on to Monday, over here you can see this is their basic dashboard and if i click on a task it just gives me the option to write a update and that is it i can't do anything else i can only add some files and mention someone and that's it i can't really give this kind of categorized information that clickup provides over here like so i can't do that on monday and that can be a hassle when you're organizing daily tasks and i can also not make a subtask within a task which can be pretty irritating over here so it's, that's something to keep in mind but on the plus side of monday adding comments is very easy if you just take a look at their basic workspace you can see this option over here and i can just add a comment directly from here so even if I'm not working on this project, I can add my own comments over here as well. So if someone else is working, they know where to make edits, where to make changes, and uh, what might they be doing wrong, or what is something else that needs to be done. Now, if you want to create subtests, you're going to have to create them from over here, and you're going to have to add this um, view or add this list as well within your uh, basic workspace and that can be irritating because not all tasks are going to have a subtask but it's going to show up for each task as well and that can be a bit annoying now you can see your sub items like this but that is something not everyone wants to view and not everyone wants to see all of the different subtasks that are available on a single project so that is just something in my preference clickup does better and you might think that the monday.com uh, setup is a bit better but i just think clickup looks a bit neater so in terms of boards and views both of them are pretty similar and if i were to add or take a look at their templates this is a template and so is the clickup version a template both provide with a good number of templates and if i were to add a board it's very easy i just click on the top right over here and i can add any kind of board i want however i can't add any integrations or automations on monday now this feature feature might look like it's provided but once i click on it it's going to ask me to subscribe to a premium version which i am not here to do now moving on in terms of viewports on clickup i can add so many different kinds of viewports so over here is my list view then i can open up my board view like so so i can view it in the board form i can also view it in a calendar form like so I can view it in my docs, so all of my notes are going to be present in my docs. And all of this is available on their free version. I can also view it as a timeline, and I can add any of their views provided. And there's only a limitation of only being able to add a hundred, but even a hundred is a lot. And I don't think you're really going to run out of your um, dedicated number of views anytime soon if you're using the free version. I don't think you could even run out of 100 views in maybe one year. I don't think you're gonna use them like so unless you're going crazy or something. But you can add a mind map, add this like so. You can add our tasks over here and you can see over here we've added a mind map and any of these views. So the list, board, calendar, Gantt, timeline, box, table, mind map, workload, activity, maps, docs, chats, embedded, or form views are all available on the free version. Obviously, there is a number limitation, but uh, the number limitation is pretty high. But on monday.com, if we take a look at our views, 
you can see this is just my main table and that then I can only have one dashboard and that is it. And on the dashboard, I can only have one widget. I can't add more widgets on the um, dashboard that I have created because that is going to be only available on the premium versions of monday.com. So these are the only two views you're gonna have if you're using the free version of monday.com. And this really does uh, disappoint me because if I was using this as a personal project manager so for stuff that only I'm going to organize myself on uh, I would really like to use this because they provide you with more storage in comparison to ClickUp and obviously the limitation is the number of people you can add but if I was to use it as an individual I would want to view my data in different forms which Monday is really limiting as compared to its competition so in general I think uh, ClickUp really does win because they provide you with all of the basic features, all of the basic building blocks that you need for a free project manager. While on Monday's free version, you're gonna have a lot of hiccups and a lot of little irritating things that are going to be uh, prickling you and annoying you as you try to work on their platform. So that was my opinion. Uh, if you think that you can still use monday.com, uh, you can go ahead and try it. You can also even try their premium versions for free for seven days. But in general, this is just what you're going to get on the free version, nothing more. And I hope you guys found this video helpful and I will catch you guys in the next video.